Hello friends, welcome back to Code Tonight. In today's video, we will be learning how to use URL encryption in ASP.NET MVC. So, what we have is we will try to create one anchor tag here and that will encrypt the query string and then we will be decrypting that query string in the action. Okay. So, for example, I have created one helper method here. So, this helper method you can see uh, in the encrypt classes that we have here. So, here we have this uh, helper method, and <coughs> this helper method basically will encrypt your query string. Okay, now uh, we will provide you the code, so don't you worry about that. So, what will this helper method do is we will pass the name that we want to show on the anchor then there is the URL and the and there is the controller and the action method where it will redirect and then you have to pass the parameters that you want to pass okay now another option we have provided is the class names if you have any HTML option to be added then you can add here so this uh, Helper method will generally create a anchor link, anchor tag, uh, which will have the parameters as the encrypted ones. Okay. Now, when you have encrypted parameter, the main thing is when you will decrypt that. Okay. So to keep things simple, what we have is we have created one base controller here that is global controller. Okay, and we will be calling that uh, as the base controller everywhere. Okay. Now this controller we have created one action attribute so that is encrypted action parameter attribute now this will decrypt the query string so it will decryption will happen only when this attribute is present on the action okay so wherever you want to react with encrypted parameters there you have to put the attribute okay so for example we want to redirect to here so we will add the uh, attribute here action attribute here okay so now it will decrypt the query string and will fill the data inside the parameters so you will not have to do additional anything to get your value decrypted okay so we will see how it works So here I have one action tag that is created from the same HTML that I have showed. Okay. Now you will see that here we have passed id equal to two. Okay. So now uh, I will click. Uh, I will over the button and you will see that uh, encrypt q equal to that is the encrypted string. So that is non readable now if i click on that it will go to encrypt and it will get the value to inside the parameter now if you just run the code you will see the url is encrypted here and still you are able to get the value in the decrypted format so that's how basically url encryption works in asp.net mvc uh, you can even decrypt everything here in the code by using the decrypt method but uh, that is like problematic because you have to do it manually but this action attribute is basically providing you a common way of decrypting everywhere so if you have 10 methods or 10 actions you can put this attribute everywhere and then it will work fine <coughs> so talking about the code if you want to get the code then you can open up codetonight.com that is our official website okay so i will show you so you have to go to codetonight.com and we will also provide you a direct link so don't you worry about that and here you on the right panel you will see url encryption in sp.net mvc so go to that and here you can download the attachment from here and you can even copy the code so in the download attachment you will be able to find the complete source that uh, i have just showed so you can copy that from there okay so if you have an issue then you can comment on the video and if you feel it is working then don't forget to subscribe the channel so thanks for watching guys and take care